previously on. Confirmed reports, I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. What the fuck? Oh God. <laughs> We're gonna be okay. I love you. I love you. Oh <gasps> what? What the f- <gasps> Yo, what the fuck? You fucking grimy bastard, you killed my man! Now back to Fallout 4, Episode 2. Is there anything in this computer that I would need? Okay, so these are the entries to when we first got here. Okay, let me see. God, it's finally happened. The world's over. Barely got all the residents inside. Not everyone made it. Yeah, I just relived it. Now it's just us and the icebergs. Fuck you, bitch! I don't get it. Eggheads tried to explain to me that keeping them frozen is a big experiment for a better future or something. I don't know. It just doesn't seem right that we were smiling at them all that time before putting them on ice. Shouldn't we have told them something? I knew you motherfuckers were being suspicious. Wow. I can't. I can't. Okay. Let me see. Christmas Underground got together with the rest of the security boys and support staff and had a little party. Best gift that got handed out was a fancy lad snack cake that wasn't too stale. None of the scientists came. Overseer wasn't there either. I just don't get them. They hiding something from us? Another company seeker only for the higher ups? Whatever. Just a few more months. Just a few more months until the all clear is supposed to come through. Then we can start rebuilding. Only a few weeks left in our mandatory shelter period. Everyone's getting stir crazy. Some people are even saying the all clear signal is never coming. We can't stay here much longer, that's for sure. It's not just the fact that I've been staring at the same break room and bunk bed for over six months. It's the fact that we only have enough food left for another few months. Tops. The overseer keeps telling everyone to be patient, focus on work. He's definitely keeping us out of the loop. Something bad is going on, I just know it. Hmm, trouble in paradise, I guess. The main door accessing the vault exit is malfunctioning. Now the only way out is through the overseer's evacuation tunnel. How convenient for him. He has one of the science team watching the door into his office at all times from a little makeshift checkpoint. Got invited to a meeting tonight. Support staffers and security only. Sounds like I'm not the only one with an axe to grind. No all clear from vault Tech is coming. We need to leave. We're all but out of food. I almost murdered Stanley for dropping a damn salt cracker on the floor. <laughs> Same. Handful of us confronted the overseer about opening up the vault. I never knew a man that small could shout that loud. Now he's locked himself in his office, along with the rest of the science staff. We're supposed to hand over any food, weapons, and medicine we have by tonight, or there's going to be consequences. I've talked to everyone. It's time. One way or another, we're getting out of this vault. Shit. Huh. Hmm. That would explain why there's no staff here. Then again, are they dead? Did they somehow manage to even escape and decide to leave us icebergs here? I can't believe that guy just referred to us- Oh my god, it's a cockroach! Oh my god, it's a fucking cockroach! Okay. Alright, bitch. All right, R2, got you. Ew! Oh my god. What the... Giant roaches? What the hell? Yeah, you're telling me. Brad roach me? You need to tell me I can eat this shit? Fuck it. YOLO. 
Let me see what else is in here. Okay, so I assume this is where the security and staff used to sleep. Yeah? Nothing in here for me to take, I guess. Oh, this bathroom is nasty as fuck. I would freak out. Anything for me to take? Nah. Dead ass. There's nothing for me to take. Okay, what's this? Let me check out this computer. Top 10 what? Oh, there's a game here? Eh. I'll play with that game here. I'll play with that game later. Alright, now I need to escape. Ew. Okay. Alright, if there's any more fucking roaches, you better come out right now. Oh my god, there's a body over there. Let me just... Come on over, come on over, babe. You mean to tell me this cockroach is gonna attack me and I got blocked like that? Fuck out of here. Ew! Ew, it bit me! Oh my god, I'm so fucking violated! Okay. Oh. <gasps> Oh, that bitch is- <laughs> I don't want a cookie. What the fuck? That shit flew with my fucking face! <sighs> okay. What happened here? Where is everyone? Dead, bitch! Everyone fucking died! What do you think happened? <gasps> Fucking cockroach. Okay. Or, uh, no! Oh my god. I can't wait to get the fuck out of here! Oh my god. I, I, I can't. I gotta get out. This shit is bugging. This shit is fucking trippy. Uh, another dead person. But hey, I got stim packs. <gasps> Finally a gun! Oh, thank the lord. All that's left? I mean, literally, yeah. If you want to think about it. Mmm. Wow. <gasps> Yay! More bullets! Radway. I'll take that. I believe Radway helps to keep the radiation levels down when you eat affected food or drinks that has heavy radiation, from what I remembered. Ugh, oh, great. A good gun, but I can't get it because I don't have anything to unlock. Alright. Let's go. Okay, so I used that computer to open up this door. Hopefully it will lead me to the outside and there's a whole bunch of cockroaches. What the fuck? <sighs> I hate anything that has the word cock in it. Cockroaches. cock a doo doo, -doo. Cockle spaniels. Fuck you all. Oh. Ah! No! Ah! Ah! Ew! Yo! Stop! Yo! Stop! 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 Oh my god. <clears throat> okay, so all of the cockroaches are now dead. <gasps> Back the fuck up, bitch! Anyways, rad roach meat? Mm. Fuck it. Okay. So all of them are all dead. That's good. I'm. <gasps> I'm like so triggered. These things fly in your face and they fucking bite you. What fucking nerve? Okay, exit zone. So, right here. Whoa, what the fuck? Fuck sneaking.
Wow, what the fuck? Oh god. Yeah, oh god. Oh god is right, bro. Like... Ooh, ammo. Everyone's dead, bro. Oh god. Yeah, seriously. Ooh. What's that? Oh shit, another cockroach. You son of a bitch. Come here, ho. <laughs> oh my god. Anyways. Okay. Well, he's not gonna use it, so might as well take this shit. Am I right? Now this pip boy is way smaller than the one I've seen in the beginning of the game, so thankfully it's not gonna be too heavy to use. Wow. Hey, the little pip boy icon. Okay, so right here, this is how you would access the menu. Um, right here shows your stats in terms of your defense, radiation levels, your health, everything. Inventory, what you have in terms of weapons, clothes, aid, all that other stuff. Data would have your quest along with your workshops. Got your map here so you know exactly where to go to. And holy cow, this is a big map, but I am excited to explore everything and everything. And uh, then we got the radio, which there's none, so. Okay, so. Let me use my stim pack to rejuvenate myself so my health can go all the way back to level, level 100. And, um, let's get the fuck out of here. Okay. Perfect. Wow, I'm finally getting out of this bitch. Fuck you, cockroaches! Stupid assholes. Some fucking nerve. Wow. I just thought of something. This is gonna be my first time getting out of this place after everything's been bombed out. Is it actually gonna be breathable at this point? Oh, Lord. I'm walking into the light. I feel like I'm... dying again. <sighs> oh, Lord. Alright, here it goes. I literally have nothing to lose at this point. I mean, husband's dead. Kid's kidnapped. My whole house probably destroyed. Everyone else is dead. Like, I literally have nothing to lose. Alright. Let's go. I'm ready to go. Do you want to change anything? Nope. I like the way I am. Enjoy your return to the surface. <sighs> Okay, so I assume it's breathable since I haven't died yet from inhaling this new oxygen. Holy shit. Holy fuck. This is a day and night difference. I remember in the same exact spot right here. Full of green trees, beautiful houses, and now look. Piece of shit. Everything's a piece of shit. The fuck?
You know me, I like to scavenge, so let me see if there's any good shit for me to take. Okay, okay, nothing. And what's in here? Yes. I like this. Okay. Yeah, I remember the the plane was right here. Right here. And the gate. The people down here. Yeah, people down here. Oh. Mm. Wow. More blitz. I like that. Now, from what I remember playing on this game, the bottle caps are used as currency, so I'm going to take as much as I can at this point. Wow. Why am I... Wait, L3 to sprint? Okay, I don't want to run, though. I can't believe them. Them... Being here like this. Yeah, this is the same bridge that me and my hubby crossed. And these two people were here, just. Wow. Sanctuary. How fucking ironic. Yep. This is my neighborhood. What the fuck? Is that Codsworth? Get the fuck out. Codsworth! You son of a bitch! You fucking survived! Bro! What the fuck? Hell yeah. So other people could still be alive too. Well, of course I'm still here. Surely you don't think a little radiation could deter the pride of General Atomics International. But you seem the worse for wear. Best not let the hubby see you in that state, huh? Where is sir, by the way? Dead. Dead as hell. <sighs> They came into the vault. Maybe you saw them. They had guns and strange outfits. Mm, only Miss Rose's boy running around in his Halloween costume more than a week early. <laughs> I swear, the nerve of that woman leaving her brat unsupervised. Oh, not like you, Mum. You're the perfect mother. <laughs> and Sir is. Uh... Oh, Lord. They... They killed him. Oh, Mom, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this, this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or, or perhaps charades. Oh, Sean does so love that game. Don't you mean charades? <laughs> Who the fuck says charades? He's gone. God damn it. Someone took him. They stole my baby. It's worse than I thought. Hmm? You're suffering from hunger induced paranoia. No, hunger what? Eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> what did you just say, bro? 200 years? rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack. <laughs> you must be famished. Okay, so at times people will withhold information or caps. You can attempt to persuade them into sharing both. The difficulty of successfully persuading someone is indicated by color. Yellow, easy, orange, medium, red, hard. 
So being that my charisma level must be good enough, let me try and click on this option here. Codsworth, you're acting a little weird. What's wrong? Mm. He about to cry. Hmm. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets our nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing! That's hardcore. Don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. And the car! The car! How do you polish rust? Oof. Stay with me, pal. Focus. I'm afraid I don't know anything, Mum. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain that you and your family were, were dead. I thought so too. I, I did find this hollow tape. I believe so was going to present it to you as a as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. A hollow tape? What's on it? I believe it's a private message for you. My etiquette protocols would not permit me to play it for myself. Any standard holotape reading device should be able to play it back. Oh, like that pip boy on your arm. That should work brilliantly. How convenient. Now, I'm feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? Sir and young Sean may turn up yet. Have you seen anything dangerous? Oh, just the usual, Mum. Pesky neighborhood dogs and mosquitoes. Shall I investigate? Let's go. Right. Fuck it. Lead the way. Proud to serve, Mum. All right, let's go. I'm following you, Codsworth. Oh my fucking god! I've been asleep. For 200 years? How the fuck am I walking? Ew! What the fuck is that? Ew! What the fuck is this? This is a fly, bro? Oh my god, that's disgusting. Flies the size of fucking cats? Yo, I'm about to commit. Because I am not about to live in a world of war cockroaches and flies are this fucking huge. Like, that's fucking nasty. Alright, what's in here? Oh, Ew. I fall! This bitch did not shoot something from its asshole at me. That's why you're fucking dead. This is so fucking disgusting. I am disgusted. Ew! What the fuck, bro? Oh my god, that's nasty. Yo, they dead ass try and shoot their shit at me. Fucking whores. Sean's out there, Codsworth. I need to find him. Yeah. I conquered, Mum. A few people there. And last I checked, they only pummeled me with sticks a few times before I had to run back home. Concord? There's still people alive in Concord? Yes, although they're a bit rough. Hmm. Do you remember the way? Just across the southern footbridge out of the neighborhood and past the red rocket station. Oh. Thank you for the reminder. Okay. So that means I get to explore all by myself. How convenient. Damn. Well, I guess I'll start walking from here. Meanwhile, let me see. Let me see what's on that hollow tape. Hold on. I forgot where to... Ah, I found it. I 
think Sean and I need to tell you how great of a mother you are. But we're going to anyway. You are kind and loving and funny. <laughs> That's right. And patient. So patient. Patience of a saint, as your mother used to say. Look, with Sean and us all being at home together, it's been an amazing year. But even so, I know our best days are yet to come. There will be changes, sure. Things we'll need to adjust to. I'll rejoin the civilian workforce. You'll shake the dust off your law degree. But everything we do, no matter how hard, we do it for our family. Don't say goodbye, Sean. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Bye, honey. We love you. I honestly don't know what to say. It's like... I can't believe this is the same kitchen I stood. <laughs> and the fucking list is still here after 200 years. baby's room. I'm coming, sweetheart. Ah, <sighs> fuck me. This is... insane. Alright, you son of a bitch. I'm done. I'm so fucking done. You may have took my husband. You may have took my home. My life. But damn it, there's a reason why I got a second chance. And I'm gonna fucking take it and make the most of it. And the first thing I'm gonna do is find my baby. And no one's gonna fucking stop me. You hear me, life? You hear me? I know, it was a moment, I'm sorry. <sighs> this is depressing as fuck, like... The hollow tape, bro. Ew, what the fuck kind of cannibalistic shit happened here? Dog meat? Fuck it. Uh, fuck it, I'll take this outfit. Ooh, I see some weapon bag right here. Let me take a look here and see what else. Alright, so let me get out of this. Um, the wedding ring. Fuck it. Looking snazzy. Wait, hold on. Hold on, let me see, let me see, let me see. Oh shit, looking snazzy with my brolic ass shoulders. Thank you for watching this episode. This is Lover of Ladies. Stay safe, take care, and I'll see you next time.